Soldiers of Asgard, we are back in The Walking Dead. And Clementine about gets on fold. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Give crackers and cheese. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> oh, I'll be sure to get that, you that bitch. No, I'm just kidding. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we need to get some food? Oh, Duck, you act like, uh, you act like I care about you. Kenny, you get some food. Want something to eat? You get a piece of Here, jerky. Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. Damn it. Son of a poop. Oh, man. At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. So I want to give Kenny food, but I got to give Duck food. And I kind of want to give the main chick food, this chick. Because, you know. And I want to give this chick food, and I should give Mark food. And then maybe this guy, who knows, who knows what he's eating. And that chick over there. Oh, this is hard. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Okay, the old guy's fine. Here, eat something. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. You mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. I'll give it a mark. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Crap. Is that what you told him? That's not what I meant. No? Then what did you mean? All right, let's take a step back. Maybe you two should keep your distance. Fine with me. He's like, my bad, I shouldn't bring up being a racist to a racist. So I can either give it a duck and, and Kenny. It's dirty, but it's not gonna hold up forever, just like the rest of this place. We dug through those for food a long time ago. Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not, it's actually. Not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. You know that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you, if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to uh, do the right Thanks, Carmi. All right. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Maybe I can wear you out before Drug bedtime, store? if you know what I mean. Yeah. Back in a bit. All right. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Wow! Calm down. Here. Oh, heck yes! Is there peanut butter? What do you think, Duck? No, probably not.
Oh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need Yeah, you don't need food, Lee. Give it a Kenny. Kenny Mark. Two kids and then Kenny and Mark are the ones that go out to get food. To they should have more food, like energy. Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Others noticed you fed Kenny. Not such an easy job, is it? No, it's not. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Yeah, I have to keep paying enough food, but I'd rather not. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Ma'am. Ken, Lee, come here, please. Your hand is bloody as hell. He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Totally forgot that they're still infected. Oh, Lee is very surprised about that. Dude, these are new shoes. Get off me. Oh, and the eyes. You okay? Yeah, thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! He wasn't! Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? Oh, he's gonna tell. It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? 
We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. I wonder if, uh, like, if I didn't give Mark, so I didn't give the chicken the food, so I wonder if she's going to collapse, really or if food? Mark would have collapsed if sure I didn't give him do. food. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Kenny keeps us motivated. He believes in hope and knows how important it is for us not to give that up. I can't fault him for that. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the Senator? Now is not the time. Well, I'm here whenever you want to talk. Yeah, I, I don't even know what happened. Talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I uh, really appreciate that. So nice. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Jolly. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in. Uh, who's running things over there? We work as a group, all of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Well, the kid here is our newest arrival, but we're all looking forward to some food. We really need it. Well, here's to helping each other out. Well, we'd love to get you all yeah, out Yeah, I'm going to be like, oh, there's like I said, this many. plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it up. There's only two. Oh no, there's yeah, a you lot know what? more. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Damn. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on. No, check Let's the body. Maybe he saw his gun. Safe. Some ammo. That guy got hella bandited. Bandit went all pirate on him. It was like a plow. Sha sha boy. He said sha sha boy. I don't even know if that's a word. That's probably not a word. Alright, guys. Well, God, I got it here, and I'll catch you guys in the next part of The Walking Dead, Episode 2. Soldiers of Asgard, don't forget to like, favorite, and comment. And if you want a guaranteed spot in Valhalla next to me, don't forget to subscribe. Also, check out my Facebook and Twitter accounts in the description below. Thanks for watching.